I hope so, baby. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go! So summer is slowly approaching, my kids love animals and I decided why not have a crack at making this birdhouse. So here goes. So firstly I started off with scrap pieces, one being a pallet wood as you can see and then the other being the off cut plywood piece from a different project. And then I marked up where I'm going to make the cuts for the sides and the base. So the plywood that you see will be the base and then the pallet would be the side walls. So first let's get the cutting out of the way. If you have been following my channel, you'd notice that I like to work with reclaimed wood, especially pallet wood, so there is a lot of sanding involved. So let's get the side walls sanded over and let the grain come out so it's ready for a nice layer of paint. Now I'm marking the pieces for the front and the back, which will have the triangular shape at the top as the roof and I am cutting that at 45 degrees using my speed square to give it that pointy roof look. You can see me now using my ruler to mark out a slanted line to give it like a slanted look from the front. If you continue to watch you'll see exactly what I mean when I go to assemble the whole birdhouse. I have cut out one of my roof pieces as you can see with the slanted sides and now I'm just replicating that by placing it on top of another pallet piece. My daughter was just explaining how to properly sand the roof so um, thanks to her I managed to get a nice clean look. Now to make the actual hole so the birds can actually access the food I've placed a pallet or a scrap piece of wood straight underneath it just so I don't mark my workbench and cut out a circle using a circular hole saw cutter bit. This piece I've just marked out and cut will be the roof, well one side of the roof and I will get another scrap piece to make the other side. So this is the other piece and now I'm just butting up the width of one piece against the other piece just so when they are butted up against each other on the pitched roof it is equal on either side. Just a quick use of my corner clamps will clamp the two roof pieces together so I can easily drive in the screws. A quick dry fit test just to see how things are shaping up and I'm very happy with the way it's starting to look even without it being painted. Now I am securing the four walls of the house by using pilot holes and then securing it with screws and the pieces have thick enough edges for the screws to bite into so I was very happy with the strength of the whole structure. So as me and my daughter were discussing what colours to paint the birdhouse, I saw this piece lying around in the workshop and I decided I'm going to take off that railing and put it around the front porch of the birdhouse. I thought this would add a unique touch to our birdhouse. I made this by making mitre cuts at the corners as you can see and this part where I marked where the mitre cut is to be made the banister was straight beneath it so I had to still go through it and it came off so I decided to attach it with a bit of super glue. Now to attach the main house to the base I am marking it to kind of assess where the pilot holes is to go and then I will screw in through the back straight into the bottom of the house. I hope the birds like it. I'm going to paint it blue. 
do. So I'll put it in the bed house. I'll look after them. We need some more paint. What do the birds eat, Daddy? They eat bread. Okay. Rice. Yeah. Worms. Delicious worms they eat. Yeah, they do. Just a quick show of how the colours are looking, very nice. Now I am attaching these banisters by using brad nails. Because this piece of railing was very old, it had a lot of dust, it had odd bits of paint on it, I decided to just give it a wipe down with just plain clean water. As you can see, it gave it a bit of a sheen and a cleaner look, which I was impressed with. Now to attach the birdhouse to the tree, it was a bit fiddly as my drill bit could not fit into the space of the birdhouse. So I'm using a corner drill bit as you can see. Take off the lid. They bring the birdie. I need to put the seed in the birdhouse. Come daddy, let's do it. Let's put some on the back knee. Will they come, Daddy? Of course they will. This is their food. Okay, okay, okay. okay. I'm baking the veggies. Is it ready? Then now, I'm going to pour it in. I'm pouring it in. Done it. Now you have to do it. Wait. Let's put the roof back on. Now the birdhouse is ready to feed the birds. Now let's wait and see how many birds fly in. My daughter is keeping a close watch with her binoculars just to see if any birds turn up. You think the birds are going to come or something? I hope so baby. Yeah. 